Hello. <laughs> Hi, everyone. <laughs> I think I am, I think it's okay. Okay, I believe that my friends are coming. Uh, I'd like to say thank you so much for the invitation again to be here with you, uh, my friends from Denmark, my family from Denmark, it's, uh, everything is okay, everything is okay. <laughs> I am so happy to come back. Uh, today I would like to suggest something different for us, okay? Uh, first of all, uh, after the, 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 the prayer in the beginning, I would like to talk to you a little bit about mediumship, about medium, what it means to be a medium, okay? And after after this is a small part in the beginning, I would like to receive questions, questions about this subject, okay? <clears throat> I would like to, to, to receive this question about the, the mediumship, about to be medium, uh, the kinds of medium, a sort of medium, ships, <clears throat> okay? I will let you free to be to be to do questions about everything about mediumship. Okay, this is our our work today is talk to you, but not bring uh, informations from me. It's I would like to know what kind of information you you wanted to hear about it. Okay, so uh, I, I we start now. Thank you so much, Rosalie, again for this invitation. Thank you for the people from IAC, uh, uh, Roseli, Franceline, everyone that uh, they are like a, like a sister and brother for me. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Thank you so much. Okay. Let's do our prayer. I will suggest for everyone, close your eyes, please. Okay. This is good. Yeah, this is good. Because there's an opportunity to, to close the window the window of materiality. It's very important we, during the prayer, we use our skills from the spirituality, from our own spirit, okay? Uh, because this is good, it's better for us. Close our eyes. God, one more time, we are here to listen to you, to understand you, to try to understand ourselves. And understanding ourselves, we have the possibility to help more people, to help ourselves, and to share love in this world. We know this is not a uh, easy, uh, easy work. It's not, but it's very important because we are not a body. We are now on a body, in a body, but actually we are souls, we are spirit, living in the material world, in this moment, suffering a little bit about this new disease and a little bit afraid what, what the consequence of this in our lives. But we know this moment, it's a very good opportunity also for us to understand that we need to be better all the time. Today, we will work, we will talk about mediums, about mediumship, about what what means to be a medium. So, I'd like your presence in our life. I would like to say thank you for all my, my, my country that has suffering so much in this moment. And pray, in this praying, uh, share love for my friends in Denmark. They are, they are like brothers for me. So, uh, in this prayer, I'd like to say thank you and good work for us. Thank you so much. Okay. Now we are here <laughs> again. <laughs> All the time uh, I, I talked uh, with Rosalie about this, this, uh, this work, 
we never we never try to find a specific way. We are all the time open to receive from our friends the perspective of the others. And I went for the for the mark a lot of times, and all the time I see how the Danish people loves to heard about mediumship, uh, how is be a medium, and they have a very good idea about mediumship, about medium, about the spirituality, and they they make this inside, uh, over in a perspective outside of our religions. It's different in Brazil, in Brazil. And most of the mediums, most of the people that use a medium, mediumship, they are inside of some, any kind of religions. Okay, we have a lot here. <laughs> we have a lot of religion here. But the, my first, my first question, I bring my my the, the first question. Okay, <laughs> the first question is: uh, Is necessary? I am. I have a, a religion. I follow a religion. To be median, uh, yes, maybe no, or maybe yes. <laughs> yes, it's uh, it's not necessary. Of course, it's not necessary. Uh, you can be a very good median without religion, but religion it's like a compass. A religion it's like a GPS, help us to find the better way, the better path. Until our 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 uh, our best, do you understand? It's not because I, I saw some mediums uh, with religion, then it stopped to evolution, to, it stopped to, to to improve improve themselves, improve the these these mediumships. This is not a guarantee. Have a religion is not a guarantee that you you are totally saved about your mediumship. It's not. But it's a very good opportunity to be to to stay together with people that have to share the same thoughts that you have. Uh, it's a very good opportunity to be part of the community. So uh, when you when you create not only a religion but a groups, when you create groups to talk about mediumship, to talk about medium, uh, it's much more safe uh, for the mediums uh, this 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 way. Because brings for these mediums the opportunity of feedbacks, receive feedbacks all the time. This is very good for the mediums. So, to be mediums, it's to be open all the time for feedbacks. We need of feedbacks. Without them, maybe it's very difficult for us to uh, find our the best way to walk in this pathway or in the best walk of of uh, mediumship. Okay. But like I said before, I, I had a lot of friends that are medium and don't have religion. Okay, this is not uh, this is not wrong. It's only different. Okay, this is my first point. I I start my mediumship. A lot of people make this question: When you start to be a medium? When you start to be? Or how this happen? Which kind of information did you have? In your past, that bring for you the information you are medium. Okay, for me, what's very uh, strange because all my life I was medium, but I don't I don't see my life like a medium like this. Uh, my childhood, my teenager, all the time I have contact with spirits. I felt uh, a lot of things. A lot of depressions, a lot of presence, a lot, of, a lot of energy. I, I, I have a wish to touch people sick, and all the time this happened, and I, I'm still not good. Uh, I remember the first time I, 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 I was five years old, I think. I don't, I, I'm not sure about this date, but I touched my grandmother, and she had fever, and the moment I touched her. The fever comes to me. I start a fever in my body, and she be okay. So after some years, I I, I never think this like mediumship. I think this like a paranormality or a love. Uh, uh, mediumship is is one of the interpretation about love. 
of course. And uh, we know that uh, mediumship uh, can can bring for us uh, some kind of 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 uh, how can I say insecurity. This is normal. This is normal because uh, we are talking about a word uh, abstract. We are talking about a word, a word totally different from our word. Uh, I can touch in this watch. I can touch in this table, in this desk. I can touch in this computer. But I can control this mouse, mouse pad, and the mouse pad. I can control everything because I can see. It's easy for me. I can touch. Uh, but the spirituality is different. You don't have control. The spirits, the spirits have them, their own. Uh, conscience, their own choice, and sometimes they don't 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 do for us what we ask for them. This is difficult for us, and and it, it's it's very how can I say before it's very abstractive. So, how to be a good medium and handling with these abstractions? Uh, you must understand, like a medium, this is very very important. You only a way of spirits and uh, when you are doing a psychography I, I, I in the Brazilian people remember very well a very good medium here in Brazil Chico Xavier he, he talk he makes psychography a lot of books and he stay in this position here and hours making psychography hours 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 and hours and uh, amazing amazing man amazing human being and he brings for us a lot of, a lot of things from the spirituality that we never think before. And but I sometimes a, a, a reporter uh, asking for him, uh, do, how many books did you did you write? And he say, no one. I never write one book. No, but you have a lot of books, a hundreds of books, more than four hundred books. And he said, no, they are not mine. I never write these that books. Who write these books? That books was the spirits. They use my body like a extension of a pen, and they use this pen and my arm and my brain and my movements and my arm to make their books, not mine. Because this, they are these books, are not mine. And uh, he is a very good example for me because he made me understand that everything that came come from through the spirits uh, is not us, it's not mine, it's not, it's not ours, ours, me, we medians. <laughs> this part is not ours. We are only part of process. We have to understand this part. This is very, very important. Okay? Okay, I think... In five or six minutes, I believe we we can have we can have uh, some uh, some uh, <laughs> some questions about what I'm talking about right now. Okay, and I will ask for Francelini, my friend, very good translator, <laughs> help me. So you can use this 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 moment to make questions in in English or in Danish. That's okay. Uh, Roseli, uh, 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 Francelini, she's very good translator. Okay, okay. Uh, so, uh, but what was what 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 is important about the mediumship, Robert? You talk about the abstraction. You talk about the it's not yours. The the skills to healing. You you have skills to healing. No, I don't. I, I don't remember healing someone. I had some moments that I helped someone, but healing, really healing. No, it's not me. I, the spirits using me uh, like a like a, 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 a think. It's like an inje 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 injection that have a needle, okay, like a vaccination. Say for the another injection. Say say something like that. Did you see? I, I, I am healing everyone with my vaccination. <laughs> the injections is only the way. It's like we. It's like us. It's like we, medians. Okay? It's like us. Okay. 
of k okay so i uh, let me see let me try to so see i don't know how to do this oh now i can see the, the questions okay Thais Pinheiros talk to me. <laughs> okay. Okay, we, we need more time for the questions. <laughs> so, uh, I, I remember my first time I went for, for the mark, my, my perspective, I was very, very uh, not, no experience about the international flights, international uh, different countries. I didn't have these 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 experience, so I I went for 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 the mark my first my first travel, uh, light medium, from outside from Brazil, and I remember very well. I I think to myself, uh, how the persons will receive this work, how the people will will receive this work, and one spirit, a friend, very good friend, Joaquin, his name, Joaquin, comes to me and say these words in my ear don't worry about this be you only be you I, I i think to myself what he wants to what, what he really means this i now i can see very clear because uh me and she is the same even everywhere i see i saw a lot of mediums in the market a lot of people trying to develop these their maiden ships, and this is this happening everywhere. So the only thing that I can I can really to be, it's me. So I I I start this work twenty six years ago, and since the beginning I have I have some some rules. Some of these rules I bring from my. From my perspective, from my religion, from my philosophy, from my etiquette, from my from myself, of course, my own etiquette, and uh, I I I create uh, some rules to me, and these rules is the same everywhere I go. I think the spirit would like to say to me, "Don't worry. You you are in home in everywhere you go." This is exactly what I felt when I went for Denmark at the same time, for the first time. I am in home. What's amazing. I didn't feel that in another countries. Today I, I, I went for 13 countries, I think, 14 countries. And I, I never felt the same about Denmark. Uh, okay. And, uh, and, and I, okay. Now we go for the next, the first question, okay, from you. I am waiting for this. Uh, my first question, is, the first question is, do you only work with Dr. Fritz or with other spirits? I love your question because the answer, maybe I need one or two hours. <laughs> In the answer is, a short one is, of course not. I work with Dr. Fritz uh as well but not him, not only with him dr fritz is a spirit that is a doctor that using my body to make a spiritual surgery in, in people okay but another another spirits work through me doing exactly the same dr mauro dr fatima dr harikson uh a indian the name of these indians is uh i forgot i'm so sorry <laughs> There are so much, so 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 many. Uh, uh, Tupinamba, a Jain Indian from Brazil, and he was a healing in his tribe. Okay, and sometimes he came to me during the soldiers. This happens sometimes. Uh, he, Dr. Fitz, get out, uh, stay a little bit outside, and he came in the, the place of Dr. Fitz, the same spot, the same the same position. And make the surgery totally different because it's another knowledge, it's another wisdom. Everything is different, okay? And he used plants and leaves of plants. It's it's crazy and roots. 
and uh, here it's, it's totally different. The energy is different. The environment around me is different. I felt this very strong. And of course, most of the time uh, is Dr. Fritz come, principally when uh, working with patients, because he loves, Dr. Fritz loves do this, uh, uh, his work with patients. He loves help people. So he never lose the opportunity to be there <laughs> to, to make his, these surgeries. But sometimes it's not possible he come and another one comes in his place. Okay. Get, let's get out a little bit from the spiritual uh, work, of sp work of surgeries. Okay. Because I am not only a medium of spiritual surgery. I have another sort of mediumship. And I use sometimes these another mediumship, like a, a talk mediumship, to participate of meetings, okay? And in these meetings, uh, a lot of spirits comes through me to talk, to have opportunity to be listened, and people can hear them and help them with their necessities. I don't know what it, what it kind of necessity, okay? But my mediumship, this is the conclusion of, of uh, our, our, <laughs> our, my, my answer. Uh, my mediumship is not a property, it's not of Dr. Fritz. You understand? My mediumship, it's mine and of God. My mediumship, uh, uh, it's, it belong, okay? To God. If God said to me, now you don't work with healing, you don't work with every kind of mediumship, that's okay, no problem for me. <laughs> but I love to do this work with Dr. Fries, of course, because he is a very good friend. Okay? Joseli, Joseli, make a question. <laughs> Why do we need to study and train so much to be medium? Uh, because it's more safe. If, if you Take someone, in, I would like to, 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 pilot, to be a pilot of airplane. Good. Go study, first of all. Why? Because you must understand your machine. You, you, it's important you understand the condition, atmospheric conditions around you. You see a clown, what do you do? You, you must to understand what clown or what, uh, which clown of there. I can I can pass it through this clown or not? You understand? So the and of course he he be he need training, okay? He need this training to be a better pilot uh, because there's the most of uh, the, the the pilots uh, they are they are uh, the level of pilot depends of the number of hours of fly, okay? I I don't know if everyone knows that. But the numbers of hours of flight, because the, what this, this show for us, that that pilot, this pilot, have experience. He is very safe to uh, fly to him. It's exactly the same about medians. Sometimes the medians have very good, very good, um, uh, very easy mediumship, but without training, without study, he can lose them himself, okay? So be careful about this. It's very important, this question of Rosalie, because he is, he is the, 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 he have a group of people that study mediumship, and she knows, and I know, I agree with her, uh, how it's important. It's very, very important to study their mediumships, because it's very important, it's more safe, it's more, it's more easy to follow your way, okay? Very good question, Rosalie. I love it. Uh, Thais, another another question now. Okay, how to develop develop control and use mediumship during lockdown? Very good question. <laughs> okay, became a crazy man. <laughs> okay, and I'm sorry because it's not easy. It's it's really not easy. And during this moment, we are not working like like before. Yeah, sometimes uh, we, in Brazil, we open a little bit during this set, uh, September last year and we closed totally now in February in the, this year. 
uh, but we had just a few of, of, of words, not the same like before. If you look for my schedule now, it's 10% of the past, but we are still working. What I think I, I suggest, uh, like advice for my friends, medians, use this moment to study. Use this moment to, to distort it by, by themselves. Because most of the knowledge from the mediumships comes from the books, comes from the, our, our necessity, our, our searchy together, uh, our searchy, uh, deep searchy um, by knowledge, okay? By knowledge about mediumship. This is a very good thing to do now. But even then, some mediums need to work. This is my case. It's not possible I stay only study, study, study and don't work. And we, we are trying to do meditations to control the energy from the mediumship. It's not easy. It's something right new, but uh, works. Works. Not so good uh, when I compare with the work with mediumship. It's not the same. Of course it's not. But it's something very, very good to do. We are doing all uh, all week, every single week we are doing a, med a meditation. Some 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 weeks we, we do, do two meditation. Even then we have meetings of mediumship, okay? And that you use mediumship on these meetings. Sometimes these meetings with people in another countries, my friend from France, and uh, sometimes my friend from the United States, so my friends here in Brazil, we are creating a new group of study at distance uh, with my friends from uh, São Luís do Maranhão, is another another state here in Brazil, okay? And uh, we have to do this. We have to do something. We have to do, because it's not easy, that moment, this moment of pandemic, lockdown for the millions. I understand that. I am suffering a little bit. And it's not easy, okay? Okay. Okay, Vanilda. Vanilda. Do you only work with... Oh, this... I, 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 I have the answer, okay. Uh, Vanilla again. How do you know what type of mediumship do you have? Very good question. My... In my case, I had the opportunity to... to to experimentations. In my case, I started in 1995 with my cousin. He was a very experienced medium and he gave me a lot of knowledge from me about mediumship. But even then, I have to follow in the books, I have to, to do this, I have to... And in the beginning of my mediumship, I had a, I had a lot of mediumship difference, a lot of sorts of mediumship. And uh, I, 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 sometimes I heard the spirit, sometimes I see spirit, sometimes I, I make psychography. I watch a lot of psychography. Oh my God, how it's beautiful. But after some time, this psychography is gone. I don't know why. Sometimes I sit in the desk and stay hours, concentrate with the spirit, nothing coming. But if someone is sick, Dr. Fritz come. <laughs> and during, the, during this process, I figure out that everything have your place. And some mediumship I have, but they are not important. They are not necessary for my mission, for my pathway, for my work. Okay? Uh, like psychography, I don't have. And, and, and today, zero. Nothing at all. And, uh, but another one's come, like, um, uh, I don't know the name exactly, the tra translator. Uh, is, this dobramento is the word in Portuguese, but uh, it's, the, it's easy to understand. It's when the medium have the ability, they, they be able to get out from his own body. Okay, I have this, this mediumship. And outside of my body, I, you must you maybe you think oh this is like uh, a sleep no 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 it's different a sleep um, it's an uh, your your body goes in another another vibration 
and your spirit get out from your body and you don't remember this kind of this kind of of mediumship no this is made by the spirits because this is a mediumship and i get out from the body and the spirits take my my spiritual body connected with my body and go for the for the place with the patient and be uh, sometimes hospitals or this moment in lockdown all the time sometimes i see television during the afternoon and i i felt the pres i feel the presence of a spirit and i i know i have to go for the bed i stay on the bed and in two seconds i'm not sleeping if you are sleeping and someone call you come on come on wake up you wake up but not in this case when i get out from the body i'm i am totally out my 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 wife carolina she said that my brief is very 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 low and my pulse very 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 low and weak and she she said that sometimes my body comes uh, brings uh, uh like uh, spasms okay and this happened because the spirits are necessary the, my presence is there because they need of energy that comes from my body and this is spasm are the spirits take off this energy from my body you understand okay maybe too long <laughs> but uh i will just i will figure out this this during the time along that this this year this dec decades this is normal you, during the time you see how it's really important for you how it's re really uh, actually it's your mission it's your obligation it's something that you have to do and uh, something is not so important do you understand and in some moment this part that is not important they will you leave you release this part from your life this is normal this is uh, we know more than 200 kinds in sort of mediumships and it's impossible all the mediums have everyone every single one of these mediumships so uh, I, in this moment i work principally with four okay only four this is more first of all is the, the healing in the second i talked about it is the is the talking okay it's, uh, mediumship uh, about talking 31 get out from the bar i don't know the translate for english i'm so sorry and uh the 41 is um, i have the ability to make the uh, excite the mediumship is in another medium this is excitation ex excitation i think this word i don't know i have the ability to excite the uh, to, to make uh, <laughs> to make the mediums feel feel more about their own mediumship you understand this is my four mediumships okay 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 that's okay it's just a minute i have a, a new question right now Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll read for you guys. Uh, does consciousness, I'm sorry, this word is difficult for me, but I understand it's the conscience, like a conscience, exists without time. It's correct. It's exactly correct. Our conscience is part of our soul. Okay. Is the astral body traveling when you have, have pre premonitions about the future? Okay. Is premonitions come? from the spiritual guys and what is the proposal okay uh when you have a premonition i think this this is the 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 question uh these premonitions comes from the spiritual guys or they come from the they come from the it, it, what this means what how why this work how is the proposal okay okay this is easy uh, if you make a travel from Aarhus to Copenhagen that's okay I make this travel 
lot of times <laughs> and pass through the three the uh, the two big bridges okay okay if you are w walking you are, you are in the car went for the from Aarhus to Copenhagen and you be in you be there in Copenhagen and you don't see one bridge maybe you'll be confused you didn't have during this process two important evidence the bridge between Copenhagen and Aarhus they are, they are two big big bridge they are a very good evidence that you are in the right right pathway you understand sometimes our premonitions comes to make us go for the correct correct place go in the correct direction okay to show us that we are in the in the like a plague okay oh Aarhus Aarhus uh, you get out from Aarhus and you see Copenhagen I don't know maybe 250 kilometers 300 kilometers I don't know 300 kilometers okay after one hour you see 200 kilometers to Copenhagen oh I am in a good I am in the right pathway I am in the right uh, track okay Sometimes the intuition, the premonitions comes for us, mediums, not only to, to bring for us the opportunity to see the future, to see what will happen in the future, but, but also our opportunity to make our adjust in our moment, present moment, to, to if this premonition is not good, you can change something now and this, and this don't happen. This premonition is very, very good. It's only we stay in this in this pathway, you'll be there. So we have to use our premonition to like opportunity, like a source of information. This is important. You don't have to, to drive your life uh, only by your using your premonitions. Don't do this. But they are very good plagues, very good observations, very good evidence that you are you are in the good in the good track in the good uh, pathway okay i think i i answer <laughs> okay Roseli have another question all the time about medians <laughs> <laughs> of course she is talking about their uh, her her problems <laughs> <laughs> I know that. I had these problems all the time. Can I meet you without study? You start to work right right way? Uh, yes, but it's not safe. I I I I I just a minute. I will use it to sleep right now. <laughs> I'm not a device this word i'm not a device i think the the best way is study after some time still study study and start to practice after some times practice more and more and more but still studying i study until today 26 years of, of mediumship i still study so the medium that really want to walk in the safety, safety way never can stop to study. Okay? Sometimes some mediums that brings they, 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 a lot of people brings mediums for me for for, for to talk, you know, to use my experience to help them. And uh, so, uh, the, these mediums was really necessary. In the beginning, they start to, to work and they study, wait a little bit. It's rare, it's rare, it's not normal, it's not common, okay? This is not usual. What is really good, it's uh, you uh, in a group, study after this. You still study and start to, to practice after you start to practice, you practice more and more and more, but you still study. This is the, the best, the more safe way, in my opinion. Okay?
Ok. Thales, Thales, my friend Thales. <laughs> Which qualities do you need as a person to be a good medium? Ok, uh, th this question brings for us two sort of answers. What you, what you understand about good medium? It's a medium with high abilities, very good, so, so much. <laughs> Go for the for the meeting and twenty spirits comes through them, or good medium is that medium simple one. Sometimes go for the meeting and one spirit only comes through him, but he is very compromised with uh, development of the moral study, the, the mediumship, uh, a, a compromise with truth. This is where in the mediumship. <laughs> Compromise of truth, okay? Okay, a good medium for me is when you put these two mediums in the same person. Because the phenomenon of mediumship, it's very important and have results. Without result of mediumship, you don't see them. You don't see the mediumship. We just think you are, but you don't, you don't incorporate this one. You don't put inside of you. You don't say, it. I am really medium. Okay, at the same time, it's necessary that that medium understand that, like I, I talked in the beginning, never think that it's you, it's the spirit it's through you. This is very important. Take your spot. Your, your spot is not the number one. Number one is the spirit. You are only there, but it's not you. Okay? And in this, in and this media never stop to study, never stop to improve their qualities like person. So if, if when you have this both together, we have a good media. Like my my opinion, like I, I see, okay? Because I saw in my life very good mediums, expertise of of skills make surgeries or psychography and another another's another's language but outside of mediumship horrible person horrible person a person uh, uh, horrible uh, I'm, uh, <laughs> don't 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 ask me say <laughs> but because they are they are working only one part be a good medium in, in developing the skills of mediumship. But the another part, the moral part of medium, it's very, very important. For me, it's essential. So some mediums don't think like this. And for me, I can never uh, call a, me a medium like this a good medium. Not for me. I prefer that one, that it's simple, it's 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 uh, balance is a very good person he tried to do his work they don't want to he this medium don't want to shows up all the time i am good i am good i am good i like uh, applause something like that this not help mediumships this bring vanity this bring proud this bring another problems and uh, most of mediums that go in that way they will lost in the in, in the end okay Thank you so much, uh, Thales. Your question was amazing. Fantastic. Okay. And Fran. Okay. <laughs> Francelini. How can you work with in the speech center using the Kardec basis and incorporating the more new knowledge? Uh, the more new knowledge about Spiritism. Sometimes only the Kardec books and, and Bible. Are not enough, and other spiritist book are not translated to Danish. Oh, okay, very good, very good. This is a big problem, because of course the 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 Kardec's book are the base. They are the foundation of this information, but they are not everything. They are they are a very good base, and on when I am construction, I construct I construction building houses in this. I make reform, something like that. So we know that we have a very good base. Okay, you can you can make a, a, a building, no problem. If the base is not good, 
don't construct the, the uh, on top because ruin everything in the end. Uh, it's exactly about the medium ship, okay, and the knowledge. Uh, Alan Kardec bring for us principally, of course, not only this, but principally five books. These books works like uh, a base. Use this base. On top of this base, you you have a lot of books. Chico Cheve, like I, I talked before uh, about him, a Brazilian medium. That now he is not here. He is in spirituality right now. And uh, Chico Cheve brings for her more than 400 books, talking a lot of things, new things, a new knowledge, a new wisdom, things that we never think before. Uh, but all the time you see this structure of this knowledge on top of the same base of Alan Kardec. Uh, I, I think that in the future, this, this part of, of, of this legacy from Chico Shavia will be more easy to see in another language. We have this very easy, of course, the first of all was Portuguese. And I think some of these, the, the principal books, they have translated for English. I saw sometimes some of these books, but uh, it's very difficult. I, I, I say that because uh, I was the, fir the, the first uh, um, writer uh, from Ceará, my state in Brazil, that had a, a book translated for English. I was the first, the first writer. I, I think I, I don't have sure about this, this, but I think I was the first writer to have books translated for Danish. I don't know if if it's correct this this information, but and and I know that I am the 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 writer that make a more trans uh, spiritist writer, of course, that make more translator for for French. And uh, I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know why it's so difficult. I went for Paris two, one, two years ago. And, and I went for five or six libraries. I don't remember how, much, how many. We didn't, we didn't find. In, in Paris, the same place that Kardec lives 160 years ago, uh, we didn't find one. We find only one book of Alan Kardec in French. I have this book because I have to walk by five libraries in uh, bookstores. I'm sorry, library, no, bookstores. Okay, I had to go to five bookstores to find one book of uh, Alan Kardec. It's very difficult, this literature, because uh, I don't know why it's so difficult to translate or, or it's so uh, I, I would like to, to, to I, I will uh, write more books, more books in the future. I had this information last year from the spirituality. And uh, I would like, I would be very, very, very interested in, in have, my, uh, have my books, all my books translate for, for Danish. Because I understand that how it's difficult for Danish people have a, a good translator. First of all, their language is very difficult. Second one, only Danish, only talk in Denmark. <laughs> it's very, you don't have, you don't have, a, you don't have that full public, it's smaller. So, and uh, I understand how it must be difficult for the, the big uh, editors to do, uh, translate for, for, one book of Alan Kardec was, was launched three years ago. Uh, in, in Danish, in Medium's book, okay? I understand, it's very, very difficult. Uh, but it's, it's, a, it's because of this, Francelini, you'll be there. <laughs> okay, my friends, I am loving this question. I would, I would like to talk a little more, but I think we, we have to, to start to go in for our, our finish, okay? We have to do the, uh, the, the, 
give me prayer. I, I don't know if I say, okay, but the last play, pr prayer, okay? And I, I, of course, I have the opportunity right now to say thank you. Thank you so much for every um, kind of, of kindness, of, uh, of love that I received from you, my friends in Denmark. I am very, very happy to talk to all of you again. And I'm so sorry by my mistakes in my in my my <laughs> in my my English. This is not the best, but I'm trying to do my best. Okay, so you have this compromise from from me. I I all, always I will try to to give for you my best. Okay, uh, just to finish, I will answer the last question. Uh, Bolet. Bolete, she is not Danish, okay? <laughs> she knows more Portuguese than me. <laughs> Kardec books are old basic books. And have to, to read your books are easy, please. Write my books. <laughs> okay. I will. I, I have to agree with you. Sometimes it's not easy to understand Kardec. Sometimes it's, it's a, a little more... Yeah, a little bit more profound. Uh, another time, 106 years ago. So uh, the, the, the literature, everything was different. And uh, but it, but we, but we have the translate. And of course, it will be a big pleasure for me write my book for you, Bolet. <laughs> I'm so happy with your phrase, my friend. Love it. I love it. <laughs> Okay, let's go for our prayer, okay? Because my boss, Rosalie, she's here. <laughs> I have to follow the rules. <laughs> Francais, we are not helping Dr. Fritz now. You are, believe me. <laughs> I would like to go. I will go. I will go to Denmark this year, I think. I know. I, I think. I'm waiting for the vaccination because after the vaccination, I, I believe that everything will be more easy. Okay, uh, but we can talk. We can talk about this after, about the work together with Doctor Freeze during the pandemic. Okay, okay, okay. Like I say in the beginning, I will ask for you. Please close your eyes. And look for you. Without the eyes, you don't need them. Look for yourself inside of you, deeply. Look for your soul and breathe. And understand that everything they are happening right now is because we need this suffering, this disease. They are not to punish us. This disease is an opportunity for us to really understand what God expects from us and what he expect for us is that we be better better than the past better than our own past not the better than the others because we are equal in the eyes of god but we have to dialogue with god and ask for help I am not enough about everything, God. Some parts of me are failing. Some part of me have a fear and anger sometimes. I need you. I need your love. I need your compassion. I am part of you. I am part of your creation. 
So please let me feel, let me feel your presence on me. Feel me, please. Bring me peace. Bring me love. Bring me forgiveness. Look to you. You don't have holes anymore. You don't have space. You are fulfilled. Because God created us to be God's. God bless you all. And thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> I just have to say one thing to to over. <laughs> uh was not me. <laughs> okay? This prayer thanks God is rock record. <laughs> but was not me. Okay? Was a spirit that come? I don't know who is. But he came and and bring for us uh, this good metaphoric that we can it, it, what I understand if we feel sometimes uh, empty or some, uh, some, something miss, miss miss something it's because this part it's God it must to, to feel is what I understand I love it the presence of the Spirit, and I say thank you so much for them, for him, and thank you so much for you that give me the opportunity to have this moment with you. Thank you, Rosalie. I will be here every time you call me. <laughs> Big kiss for my friends, for my sister, and the Mark. A lot of friends I have over there, and it's very, very good for me to be with this moment with you. I felt you, all of this love from you all the time. Thank you so much. Thank you for Ayak and miss you guys. I will be, I will be there very, very soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>